In this video, I'm going to show you how to take a lead page and actually upload it to your server for a domain. So sometimes you may have a domain that's just a landing page or you just want a couple pages on there that you could create entirely from lead pages. So I, I recently figured this out. It was a lot easier than I realized and I wanted to show you. So first you need to come into where you're hosting your domains. and you just need to come in and change the name servers. So whatever your name servers are, change that to yours for your hosting company. We have a different hosting company right now than, than where we have our domains. And so I'm gonna go ahead and change that and I'll be right back. All right, so my name servers are now changed. And if you're not sure how to do that, just contact the company where you have your domain and the company that you have your hosting and they can walk you through this the exact steps and exactly what you need so if you have your domain and your hosting both through Bluehost they should be able to do that very easily with you if you're using a, a different company for your domains and your hosting then you'll just need to find out your name servers from your hosting company and then go in where your domains are purchased and change those name servers there. Okay, so the second step is to add on that domain to your hosting company. This is cPanel and most hosting companies have a cPanel. So you just click on add on domain and you just type in the new domain name. Okay, so now you can see that the add on domain has been created. One way you can do this is by going to the file manager and you'll go to that actual domain, the document root for that. Then you can just click upload and what you'll do is on your lead page, you'll cl click publish and you'll wanna say your own server and you wanna click down H download HTML. This, because this page will be updated automatically each time you edit it here on lead pages. So that's a really, really good thing. So you want to download that HTML and I've already done that, but just download that to your computer and then that's the file that you will upload in your file manager. And then you'll choose the file And then it says complete. All right, so it's uploaded, but now we need to come back here and rename this to index.html. All right, and that's all you have to do. Now this is uploaded as a lead page to writingweek.com. Let me move it down here so you can see writingweek.com. It's all here, and if I change something on my lead page, like let me say join writing week now so I'll save that and then I will update this and now it's updated here so it's really a great way to use lead pages to create a landing page like you know writingweek.com this is a seven day writing nonfiction writing challenge and I wanted a specific landing page for this challenge and this will most likely change um, this is just something I've put on here here in the beginning but um, I also do this for authoraudienceacademy.com and instead of doing a forward which sometimes would give my visitors an error now I can simply change my name servers at my domain to my host create an add-on domain in my cPanel that's the second step. And then the third step is to upload, or the third step is to download my lead page as an HTML. So the lead page is from your own server and download the HTML. You don't want to export the full HTML, but download the HTML so that it will be, it will be updated every time you change it. And then you will upload that file to your domain. You can use your cPanel to do that and change that file name to index.html, and here you go. 
it's up and ready. I know it does take a few steps and those of you that are really new to this, you may want to hire someone to do this for you, but I think you can be able to figure it out and be able to get it up and going um, in no time just by these instructions. All right, thanks, I hope that helped.